Oh, Billy Nelson, could we get a quick word with you? Very hard to get hold of at the moment, Billy. I'm not, aye. You actually had a conversation with me earlier on, and you pretty much nailed that straight on, didn't you? You said what was going to happen happened. More or less, I thought he'd stay down. But he's obviously got a decent chin as well, because he helped me two good shots. But he, he got helped me a good shot as well. Listen, the raw novices and they're putting a, a good display, you know, for, for where they are. As a spectacle, it was it was better than what we thought it was going to be. What a noise, what an atmosphere. You know, I think if they'd done it again, it'd be bigger and better. Why not bring it back here? I know you know boxing, Billy. Could he compete if he wanted to at a certain level? I don't, he could, but I don't want him to. Because professional boxing is a very unforgiving sport. Doing this, he can walk away for any time with a big bag of money in his, his pocket in the bank, so why not do it? You like getting involved in this. I know you listen, you've trained world champions, you've had multiple successes in your in your time, but I kind of think with your relationship with Four, you you like training him and you like this kind of thing. I just like training fighters full stop. Whether it's class acts like Paul, Paul Weir or Ron Novices like, like Arthur. It gives me a great sense of uh, achievement uh, when I see him improving. As, as Paul would tell you, he's an excellent coach as well. There's nothing that, I couldn't tell that man anything because he's got IQ way beyond me. That's true, actually. Shout out Paul Will. But it's true. I'm not one of these trainers that say, oh, he's better than me, he's, he's no as good as me. You're what you're. You work with, you work with the tools you're given. Final one, Billy, before I let you go, because I know your, your team wants to get off. What about Eddie Hall's performance? What, what was your assessment of that? Well, he was, he's obviously got something wrong with his left, his left because he was, he was trying to load up with the right all the time. But that played into his hands because he's moving away from the right hand and throwing the jab over the top. So. I don't know, he's done very well. I told him he done very well because he's a complete novice as well. Credit to you know what I mean? They're big lumps that hit each other with big shots. So, fair play to them. Thank you, Billy. Thank you.